Hello, Cancer. Welcome to your mini love reading for April 2023. Please take what applies to you only. And if you enjoy this video, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. So what is the overall energy between you and your person, Cancer? What do we need to see here? So we have number 41, forget who you are. Conditioning falls away. Memory no longer defines you. So cancer, you know, this could be a very important message for you, right? If you have some stigmas surrounding your um, reputation in regards to maybe decisions you've made in the past or just what people perceive you to be, right? Uh, spirit is telling you to forget that version of yourself, okay? Um, to move on to where you feel comfortable and in your power. This could also be about the energy of your person, right? It says conditioning falls away um, and memory no longer defines. So <clears throat> this could be something they're going through as well if they are under some sort of conditioning in regards to uh, relationships or again, their own uh, preconceptions that people have of them. Um, there seems to be this energy of taking your power back and, and knowing it's okay to start again, okay? The past does not define you if you let it in the past define you, then that day is over, okay? This is a new era. So uh, as we move into eclipse season and things start to take crazy turns, now is the best time for you to step into your power, okay? So let's talk about how this person is currently thinking and feeling in regards to you, Cancer. What are their thoughts in regards to you and this connection, Oh my gosh. So we have the Ace of Wands and the Ace of Cups, you guys. Crazy passion, crazy love. This person, they know that you are the pa the fire, the desire, the love of their life, okay? They see you as the perfect opportunity. I mean, look, this is not just any old flame. It's a blazing ball of fire. And then the waterfall representing the endless flow of love that they have for you. You know, you this person is aware of you. They know the potential that exists in regards to what can happen here between the two of you, okay? Lots of... Of lots of creative energy and I just saw 222 so uh, let's talk about um, what this person desires what is their desire here what do they want from you with you the nine of cups oh my goodness cancer this person um, is waiting for their wish to be fulfilled okay what this person wants is you you are their wish fulfillment you are their desire okay they feel as if they would be fulfilled and happy with you by their side okay um, let's get just one more let's clarify that uh, this person's desire the lovers, yeah, they, they want to choose you. This person loves you. They know that they've been divinely guided to you. Um, and maybe they've had to deal with some, some craziness in their life to get to this point, but they've been wishing for you. They've been manifesting you and, and the universe brought you to them. Okay. Um, so yeah, this person definitely loves you. They definitely care about you greatly. And I want to find out also, uh, what this person would like you to know. Okay. What does this person Person want to say to you cancer what is the message for cancer from their person whenever I try to break free it's another trip down the karmic rabbit hole oh my goodness okay so let's go back we were talking about um we were talking about conditioning falling away. So your person could very well be wrapped up in a karmic situation right now, even though they feel this intense love and passion for you. Um, and again, I'm hearing it's a new era. So, you know, this person and you could have fallen in love in some crazy circumstances, Cancer, and they're trying to break out of the karmic cycle that they're in, okay? They're wanting to set themselves free from who they used to be. Um <clears throat> What else does this person want to say? I want the opportunity to explain myself to you. So, you know, again, this person definitely would like to offer up their love and have a passionate new beginning. It's probably going to have to come with an explanation first, especially if there's third party energy involved. Oh, I hope you haven't forgotten about us. So if there's been some time in between the last time you spoke to this person and now they're hoping that it's not, um, it's not a distant memory, right? And we also have 
painting the roses red, still trying to please the karmic. So uh, unfortunately, I just feel this person is still trying to break out of this karmic cycle. They're wanting to leave that life behind. They're wanting to have this fresh new opportunity in love and, and uh, create a new path with you and choose you. Um, but even though you and this person have been divinely guided towards one another, their circumstances still have not changed is what it seems. And then to top things off, we also have, I feel so dumb for screwing this up as my throat starts cracking. So <clears throat> I think this person does want to explain themselves. They possibly want to apologize. Um, and, and they're going to have to, like I said, release that other situation if they're going to have a true new beginning in love with you, Cancer. Okay. So hopefully this resonated with someone out there. Um, if so, and you'd like to book a personal reading with me, all of my information is in the description box below. Other than that, I love you and I will be seeing you again very soon. Bye.